Hello survivors and welcome back to another episode of True Survival SDX on 7 Days to Die. Now if you're just uh, joining the channel here today, you're just finding this video for the first time, definitely go down to the description. There are playlists in there for this series as well as my other series on 7 Days to Die as well. But anyways, moving on, what we're going to do today is we're actually going to go and start uh, stoking up that forge, getting iron going in it. And since we have that good old trusty mini bike that's around here somewhere, I'm actually used to having the notification on. There she is. We're actually going to be taking that out and heading back west, the direction where we started. This is actually where I spawned in. It was over here. So we're going to be hopping on the mini bike and going this way because I do believe south leads into this nasty ass biome and I just want to stay out of there for now. Uh, now I was looking up my skills here too. If we go to skills. And we look up health and fitness. I really want to get like the survivor run for us run and the camel So I don't have to eat as much and I don't have to drink as much I don't have to spend as much time hunting, but I can't do that until I'm damn level 20 and I'm only 11 So we still got a while to go from there But I do have to go over to that church and into the basement and get that forge stocked up without causing too much trouble So this is gonna be a little bit of a go uh, but let's definitely hop down here and get our business on the way. Now, I, I think we may have a few dead friends down here because... Um, no, that's a follower corpse. That's right, those things don't disappear. Holy crap, that was a deer. I was like, what the hell is Torkin over there, man? But it was a deer. Totally forgot about that. Okay, so what I'm going to do is hop on this trash can, hop up here, and hopefully they don't follow us in too far. So I'm going to look into the forge. And we're actually going to throw um, these scrap iron tables right into the forge itself because it's cheaper that way. And then we're going to take our scrap iron and we're going to throw that in there too. And use end tables to fuel the bastard. Uh, 5 minutes and 20 seconds. Definitely not long enough to do that. So we're going to go ahead and use this here as well too to, to stoke it up a little bit. Come on, get in there. There we go. 22 minutes, whatever. That's all I really have at the moment. We'll keep it running at that. So now it's time to blow this popsicle stand, get on that mini bike, and get the fuck out of here because we got some zombie attention a big time. So I'm having a blast exploring. There is so much to go see. There is so much to do that um, I'm actually really inclined this time to go out and explore. That doesn't happen very often because, well, you get pretty bored of vanilla pretty fast doing it that way. See ya. Oh, here's a pig. Oh, and the great thing about this is too, is I can go hunting now very easily. Come here, pig. If I can catch up to them. <laughs> Man, if I could find a bear, I'd be laughing. I did find a bear, but it was a damn freaking zombie bear. I was so disappointed. All right, let's get the meat off this guy because we definitely need it. Man, I love road or uh, roadkill hunting. It's the best. So I shouldn't have really any problem with meat anymore. I can definitely say that. Oh, get away from me. I'm trying to get my meat, lady. That's right. Lay down. Don't come after me when I got meat in my hand, Arlene. Jesus, Arlene. You should know better. All right, so let's uh, let's break this down. Finish breaking her down here. And then we can put the rest of our meat into the mini bike and not smell. God damn, that's so useful. I love having that mini bike now. That mini bike in a box blew my mind when I found it. Like, I've heard of other people finding it, but actually finding it was a whole different thing. And now, um, like I said in my videos, guys, I love the feedback. I love to hear from you guys, and I love to hear um, different things about the game. Uh, but the one thing, uh, please, especially if you're uh, following the same playthrough as me, uh, you guys like to know. You guys know that I, I like to be surprised by stuff. Please, please don't tell me this POI has this in it, this POI has that in it. That is no fun for me. I actually will delete your comment if you're, if you're doing that. And uh, if you continuously do it, I'll just uh, block your comments from the channel. Because honestly, this is a first time experience for me. I, I don't want that to be ruined or have to, uh, or do what a lot of other content creators do and just fake being happy and surprised by stuff. I just, I can't be that way, guys. PewDiePie said it the best. Um, people can tell when you're like that, you know what I mean? I just, I've never been the, that type of person to uh, fake loving everything and having a great time. Like, if I'm playing something, I'm just not having a good time, you guys will know it. I'll tell you. I'll be like, oh, this fucking sucks. Like the Horde Knights. I, I'm not a big fan of the Horde Knights anymore, but I will tell you guys, this fucking sucks. You know what? This mini bike fucking sucks, but that's okay. We'll, we'll eventually get better, um, better parts or maybe even another mini bike in a box. Oh, come here, pig. I want your meat. We could have meat for days with this thing. Come here. There we go, got him. Sweet. 
Now, uh, just need a moment to harvest this guy. I should have a knife too. Wait, do it. Can I make a shiv? I can. Oops, not equip. Ah, oh, there's so much stuff in my inventory. Here we go. Okay, recipes, and we will actually make a shiv out of this so we can actually carve it out properly. There we go. And we will get rid of these guys. Oh, and there's an airdrop right there too. Sick. Okay, come here. Come here. Oh, there's three of them? Oh, we're, we're gonna have a crowd here very soon. These guys are all over my shit. You know what? Get back on the mini bike, and we are going for the airdrop. That's way more important. Uh, that body can just lay there, and these guys can go fuck themselves. Wow, that airdrop is, like, literally right on the edge of the road. That's sick. All right, let's go grab that bastard, and what do we got? We got some food, some tea. I will take that all. A steak knife. Ah, that's garbage. No no weapons or, or no... Um... Damn, health kits. I really wanted health kits. That's what I was really going for. Ah, look, see? There's another pig right up here that I can take care of. Come here, buddy. Ah, damn it. Oh, I'm stuck again. Come here. Come here, you derpy ass motherfucker. Come here. There we go. I'll just drive into a tree to stop. That That's very effective. Okay, we are going to peel this guy of his meat as well here, too. Right after. Ah, uh, there he is. He's over there. Shooting at zombies and stuff, getting some attention. Okay, anyways. We're gonna carve this guy up. Not nearly as fast, but it's more effective. I actually don't know if the shiv gives you more more meat than the, the axe will. Um, I actually should look that up. I think it was asked at one point in time, and we did a test and everything on it, and I think it was, um, it actually didn't matter, but ah, whatever. We'll, we'll figure that out down the road. Okay, speaking of down the road, let's uh, get going here. There's just freaking meat all over the place. This is insane. Come here. Like, there's a deer right here I can take care of? What happened there? Looked like a pretty non-friendly explosion. Maybe um, a cop hit a car or something. That's probably exactly what happened there. When they hit those cars, they blow up and leave a pretty damn heavy hole in the road. All right. So, oh, look at that right here, too. Or maybe that's just, maybe that's a function. Maybe that's actually how the roads look. Because that would make sense. Remember how I was saying roads would be degraded and pieces of them would be missing? Well, that leads into that whole thing. Okay, so we have a couple things off to the side over here. I don't know what they are, but... Hmm. And I could also do my, um, my starter quest at the beginning as well, too. It'd be really nice to find a trader and have a trader going. I mean, um, I, from what I hear, it's bullet casings and not um not duke's casino tokens for currency on this which is okay uh bullet because that the bullets seem to drop a lot so i really don't mind making some bullet casings for uh for currency it would really suck if it was a normal balance and you had to use bullet casings as currency because you guys know how hard it is to get friggin brass um but even in this if you guys want brass doorknobs Go and break down the regular wood doors. They, they drop brass doorknobs when they uh, when they break. But you also do need a brass doorknob to make um, to make a door. So keep that in mind. Oh crap! Oh well, <laughs> that's one of those freaking rabbits again. I thought it was a dog. Holy shit! Come here, angry rabbit. Where you at? Come here. Fuck! These things are so hard to hit. Incredibly hard to hit. There we go. It's down. It's gone. We are good to go. Let's take a look at our deer here and uh, take care of business. Uh, looks like this ship is almost broken too. Ah, well, if this breaks, I'll just I'll just use my axe. Easy enough. Or one of my axes. Many many axes that I have on me. Man, that survivor is going to town over there. Gather plant fibers. I swear I've gathered that many plant fibers before. Like easily grab that many plant fibers. Come here, buddy. Where's your head? Show me your head. I want to break it. Oh, we got some friends headed our way. So I'm actually going to go ahead and take care of these guys. And then we'll drop our meat into the mini bike. Whoa. Okay, maybe not. Uh, we have a few headed our way now. This is about to turn into disaster zone for sure. Okay, this guy's about to blow up. So I'm going to actually just move backwards here and let him do his thing. And boom. There we go. Plants, fibers all over the place. All right. Oh, we got some stem from that nurse. Very nice. Now, there we go. Now he's broken down and I got the two extra bones. So I'm going to actually go ahead and we're going to hop on this mini bike and head back over to the road. And then from there, I'll go and put the stuff in my inventory. This next section, I'm actually going to want to be driving through just period. There we go. So we get rid of that meat on me and we will just 
head right through this biome because fuck this biome. This shit is tough as balls. Uh, now this mini bike isn't as fast, but the the nice addition of the mini bike is. Oh hi sleeper zombie. Oh man, that's a corpse. <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, the nice thing about the bike is I don't have to use my own stamina to ride it. You know what I mean? Uh, and the one thing about that city was. What is this? Rad mushrooms? Damn right. Picking up them rad mushrooms. I don't know what those are, but we're going to take a look at those after. Holy shit, here's another one of those fucking tank guys. Those things are insane. Man, so it is It is these biomes. So each biome has harder and harder mobs in it, which, which makes sense, really, if you think about it. Um, so the forest biome was a great city to come across for the first attempt. I think that's where a lot of people are like, holy crap, when I came to a city, there was shitloads of zombies everywhere. And I think that was the case because you went into a really shitty biome. What is this? There's a lamppost over here. Let's go check that out. Why is there a lamppost over here? No reason. There just is a lamppost over here. Oh, yeah. All right. Makes sense. Whatever. Let's, um, let's go off the beaten path here and then back onto the beaten path. <laughs> There's a little bit of a shortcut right there. What do we got over there? Something's glowing. What is that? Oh, I want to check that out. Oh, that's waste. Can I can I do anything with it? Nope, I can hit it though. But my instinct tells me to get the fuck out of here and stay away from that. Because I hear a bee above my head and those things are never friendly. Or a hornet, whichever you prefer. Ah, nice. There's a big ol... Ooh, did I find the hub? I might have actually have found the hub. Okay, I can actually look at my map here. Wow, look at this biome. This is intense. Okay, let's go check out the city. I might not be able to do much in it, but uh, we'll, we'll go and check it out. Check out what it has to offer us. Oh, that was awesome. What? What? Why can't I use my mini bike? Holy shit, though. I fucking own that police cop. That was... that or police cop. That cop zombie. That was freaking amazing. Okay, why can't I loot you? What the fuck? Did I break my mini bike? Uh, oh, the chassis broken. Damn it. So I broke the chassis on the fucking cop's head right outside the fucking, what, what, what looks like a, um, a hub. So it looks like I'm going to be stuck here for a little bit until I find some repair kits or something. Damn, man. I did not plan that one out correctly. Oh, shoot. Stupid cop head. Destroying my shit on me. Looks like we're doing okay here, though. Um, I think I can handle this for the most part. Oops. As I say that, we get spit at. All right. Um, what I'm going to do is actually just mark this as my mini bike. There we go. So I'll know where my mini bike's sitting. And we'll come back for the mini bike as well. Not much I could do at the moment. <laughs> what, uh, what, uh, you know what? I would laugh if I actually found another mini bike in a box. And holy shit, did that ever hurt. Okay, we're, we're out of here. Uh, I'm going to use some painkillers. And we will move our way into the city here and see what it's got to offer. Oh, man, the old POIs. I miss the old POIs in the, in the wasteland. A cop car? What? No way, that's cool. Okay, what do we have here? We have a huge shotgun messiah. That's perfect. That's exactly what I need. That's going to give us tons of weapons. Now, let's see if we can get something to spawn in here so we can, uh, we can get them to break out. Oh, wow, look at all the shit in there. That's awesome. Okay, uh, we have... <gasps> yes, we have a POI malfunction, and we can actually get into the POI this way. Sick. We's about to do some sweet looting. Uh, what I'm going to do is we'll actually use... Uh, I don't want to use a beverage container because it's, it's right at an edge. So if something spawns in here, we're going to have a hell of a time. Uh, what can we use? There's counters and stuff over here I know we can use. Where are you at, counter space? Shopping cart? You know what? Shopping cart. Shopping carts really don't get fucked with that much. So I'm going to remember that I left a bunch of crapola in the shopping cart. Well, I probably won't remember it, but I'll try to remember it. And we'll just eat both of these things so that I, I'm not uh, thirsty. There we are. We'll put the cans. Actually, the cans and the nails, I'm going to just go ahead and start scrapping that stuff down because we need it anyways. There we go. And uh, rad mushroom. Strange looking mushroom, it doesn't look edible. Okay, those are probably useful for something down the road, but not quite yet. We'll, we'll figure that out. 
All right, where's my torch? We gotta get that little bastard out here too so that I can actually see where I'm going. There's my torches. And so you guys can at least half ass see what is going on. So let's start breaking open some of these containers and hope for the best. Come on, give daddy some sugar. What do we got? Man, that eight second wait. Seriously. <laughs> Soon enough, my friends, we're almost 25 for scavenging. Uh, we got some gun oil. I will take that. That doesn't seem to drop too often, and it's probably actually how you repair guns. I would assume. I would assume that's how. Okay, so we're going to break this one open here. Then I'll uh, remember to take my torch out right away so we can all see what's going on. Did they get in here? I don't think they got in here. They're outside for sure, but they're not in the building yet. Uh, we'll find out, though. That's for, that's for sure. Come on, 8 second loot time. Give me something good. Ah, eleven gun oil again. I don't need gun oil. I need weapons to put to use that gun oil on. Yep, they're definitely outside. Am I? I'm sensed. That's okay. You know what, guys? Go ahead and start punching holes and shit. Like, give her down because it'll make it easier to get in and out of this building for me, anyways. Not that I ever need to come back in here because um, because I can't reload it. But how? Whatever. Ah, uh, garbage. It's just a short stock. Okay. Give me some sugar here. Well, it sounds like it sounds like the city's actually got a lot of survivors in it. <laughs> I love this. I like the randomness of the land inside the building. That's freaking awesome. All right, what's this bad boy have for us? All you can hear is like mass gunshots going off. <laughs> All over the place. All right, here we go. One more second. And just some ammo and stuff. Man, no weapons this time around? Are you kidding me? And this is ne this one even has a ton of crates in it. All right, let's break this one open. Uh, now, this POI is actually the one they use in Navis Gain. I... <gasps> Whoops. I never... Um... <laughs> Why did I do that? Apparently, there's nothing in it anyways. Or it doesn't drop when it breaks. Man, it was already un unhatched my bad um ah here we go but this one's using the navis gain i never understood why they never use the navis game pois in the random gen maybe they're too big or i don't know but these these pois are great finding one of these stores is gold oh there's a weapon repair kit i don't think i can repair my mini bike with that but we'll, we'll take a look at it as well uh we got whole tons of cupboards here and cabinets to open up oh i do like the grass and everything growing inside that's pretty cool it's a nice little added touch. Ooh. That thing sounded violent as fuck. I don't know what that was, but that, that, that sounded like something I really don't want to be fucking with. Ah, here's another cabinet. So we're searching for food, for water, of course, as usual. And then we'll break into the back room and see what the back room has for us. Because we can break through these walls. These walls are easy to get through instead of trying to go through the metal door. Uh, I'm going to eat that. We're going to go ahead and... Um, just take the pears, I guess. Man, there must be a ton of them outside. Either that or they're in the back room. But there definitely is a lot of them. Okay, is there any more crates? There's got yeah, there's there's tons of crates in here. Uh, there should be one up over here. And there is nice. And it is not broken up yet, so we need to uh, open it. Oh, looks like a survivor outside has broken their weapon. I really don't like how it tells you that. That's really odd how it does that. It's probably um, uh, built right into the game, though, so there's not much you can do about it. Okay, what do we got? Uh, revolver grip. Damn it. No full weapons. Man, I've had more luck on a rooftop with crates than in an entire store of them. <laughs> Whatever. It is what it is, right? We'll, uh, we'll figure this out. Okay, and we still have that back room to search as well, too, so that's not so bad. There we go. Nothing in those cabinets. Uh, lockers. Maybe we'll try the lockers. And like I said, I don't even think there's um, uh, there's um, a headlamp in this game at all, like in this mod at all. So Horde Knights will be a little... Oh, wow. As soon as I said that, I found a fucking mining helmet. Nice. Nice. And then I'm going to scrap that. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. We have lights. We have light. I am so pumped about that. I just, as I'm saying, I don't think there's mining helmets. I found one. Maybe that's what it takes. Maybe that's what it takes. Saying, I don't have it, and the game will give it to you. Man, that's amazing. Sweet. Now, Horde Knights will be a fuckload better. Um, I could have cheated and gave myself a headlamp, but fuck cheating. I'm here to play the game to have fun. You know what I mean? 
All right, one more locker, and we should have the front done. We'll bust into the back and see what it has for us. Man, this trip's just worth it just for that mining helmet, like, hands down. I don't have to hold a torch anymore. I won't have to fuck with anything, and there's a tree growing through the back of this, and holy shit, the whole back end is exposed. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go in that way. We're actually going to go in over this way, and I'll see what I can find. Um, now, it, there's a thing with um, random gen when the POIs spawn in that uh, they get broken spots in them, just like random pieces missing. And I think that's what happened in that corner over there as well, too. Definitely taking these tables, because these tables are worth so much in iron. Iron's so hard to get, especially in the early stages. Oh, man. Come on, give me some magic. Oh, compound bow, two repair kits, and carbon arrows are very nice. Uh, so I'm going to just go ahead and scrap that. Uh, I'm going to start going ahead and scrapping some of those as well, too. Sweet! Finally got some weapons! That's what I was looking for, damn it! Okay, can I, do I have room to pick that up? Uh, sounds like they are definitely inside. Oh, no, they're right there. Okay, so we still have a second here to get this done. I'm going to pick up that scrap table, pick up that scrap table, and we'll break these open. And hopefully that wall holds, holds here for a second. Because I don't hear a break yet. We're going to hear that... Oh! Oh! That sounds like some damage right there. Okay, what do we got? Oh, that was a cop spitting. Yep, they're in. They're in. Okay, uh... What can we do about these guys? You know what? Holy shit! That guy, that guy torques, that's right. Okay, um, we are gonna actually go outside, wrap back around to the back, and see if we can't take care of these guys, because I, I don't want to get stuck standing in the back just like that. That'd be a, a little silly of me. Okay, here goes one. Anything good? Nope, just seeds. And we have a fire zombie here. Oh, and we have an actual dog. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't let this thing bite me. I don't want to bleed. Bleeding sucks balls. Oh, and we got a spider as well, too. Okay, okay. We got to get this business under control here. Man, it seemed like staying in that building was a really good idea. Oh, damn it. That was close as fuck. I did not want to get hit by that cop spit. Okay. So since we have them all up front, what we're going to do is I'm going to kill this dog. Because that fucking thing is going to haunt me and I know it. Come here. Man. How many shots are you going to take, dog? Okay, let's uh, let's go in for the, uh, the headshot there. Did that not take a mouse yet? Holy shit. Okay, that dog is tough as balls, man. I'm going to call him Gramps. He just keeps going. Holy shit. <laughs> Look at him jump around. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, I'm not bleeding, so we're okay. Wow, look at all the zombies all over the place. Where the fuck did you guys all come from? <laughs> Holy fuck. All right. I'm going to see if I can make it around to the back of the building and get some extra time to loot. What I'm going to do is use this old axe and see if that gets us through those containers any faster. Because holy crap, that's a lot of zombies. Yeah, no, it definitely doesn't get us through those containers any faster. The axe does a way better job, and it's way better high level. Anyways. Okay, we're still okay. We're still okay. I should be facing that way and looking. But I'm not going to do that, because that's smart. Holy shit, look at all this stuff in here. Pipe bombs, nice. Okay, what can we get rid of here? I'm definitely taking those pipe bombs. Uh, these things can stay for now. Uh, you know what? Let's actually, let's go ahead and take care of some of these fucking zombies with those pipe bombs. It's been so long since I've used one. Alright, oh, here they all are. Okay, so I gotta get into my inventory, and then we'll get the pipe bombs into my tool belt and take care of some of these fucking bastards. Wow, that's insane. Okay, where, where'd they go? Here they are. Pipe bombs. Nice. Whoops! <laughs> I didn't throw it. Oh, well, that works. Oh, my God. There you go. Eat that shit! Wow, it does, like, fuck all to them. Holy crap. Look at them all. That's just a mass load of zombies. That's absolutely insane. I'm actually going to print screen this shit. Because I can't actually take a screenshot. There we go. Print screen done. Uh, when it's in SDX, because it's actually not loaded up in Steam. Man, I just have zombies chasing me everywhere. Um, what I should actually start doing, too, is looking for a place. Oh, shit! I seen it last second as well, too. 
Holy fuck. All right, well, I need to get my backpack back. So what I'm going to do here is we're going to take a break. Fucking landmine got me too, son of a bitch. We're going to take a break. I'm going to uh, walk my ass back there and hopefully make it back there by night. Grab my backpack and then we'll nerd pull on top of a, a building here for the night. Uh, if it's nighttime, by the time I get there, guys, I'll just cut back to the morning. I'll see you right after this break. Oh, and quick hint. If you're in the building screen... Um, oh, shit. Am I going to... Yeah, I'll be able to nerd pull over here. I left some stuff here. Um, if you press tab while in the building environment screen, it'll actually bring you back... Um, it'll bring you right into the game. Uh, you don't have to wait through the building environment. But anyways, guys, I'm going to take a quick break. We'll take a quick break here, and I will see you either when I get back or in the morning. I'm actually going to grab some of these stone axes. I'll see you guys very shortly. Welcome back, survivors. So I'm on top of this incredibly awesome place. Um, I've looked down there, and I don't know what to make of this. I, I really don't know what to make of this down here. I don't know what it is. I'd love to go check it out, but um, previously, couldn't get into here because it's all metal wrapping this whole entire building. So it's not exactly easy to get into. Like, this would be easy if it was this shit. I can get in. I can get in quickly. But down there, it's all metal, so we couldn't get in. But one day... We'll get in there. Now, a little bit of explanation. I pulled a big stupid. This is supposed to be Monday's episode. But I once again put my mic on mute and didn't unmute it to record the episode. So there's absolutely no audio to the uh, day 11 at all. And unfortunately, I can't just undo day 11 then redo it again. But to catch you guys up, we found out um, that there's not just survivors in the hub. There's also raiders as well. And they have impeccable aim for headshots. So I died one more time. Um... We went and we went back to my broken ass mini bike and grabbed our meat so that we have a little place up here. I have put a bedroll back down on top of this building just in case. Oh, actually, speaking of, you know what I'm going to do? Um, since we got so many hay bales, I hit up a barn and we got a whole ton of hay bales. Um, I'm going to leave some there just in case we can't nerd pull. Oh, getting down from here is going to suck. Oh, well, I have hit. Whatever. We'll figure it out if I die. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. But uh, we also found out... Oh, yeah. No, we already ran over the Raiders. There is Skippy catch up. It's actually the next day here again, so I'm kind of trying to catch myself up to the previous episode and catch you guys up on what you miss since there is absolutely no audio. Uh, but I did find myself. I don't believe we covered this in the uh, first half an hour. I do believe this was the next day. But we did find a mining helmet. So I have a mining helmet going on now. Most excellent. That is friggin' awesome. So, you guys don't have to suffer on Horde Night anymore. You can see. And I'm sorry, guys. I wasn't about to cheat in a headlamp just to make the videos a little brighter. I know it sucks for the first little while, but it's part of the game, right? And that's... I want the game to be um, immersive, right? And part of being immersive is that darkness, especially on Horde Night. So, uh, it is what it is. But we will move this glue into one of these random storage. I'll just put it in this storage chest. So now we have a whole area up here. I'm just going to go ahead and scrap that. Now we have a whole area up here that's completely safe. I have a fire pit. I have a forge up here and a couple of friends if I need so. If I need, so, if I need something to put my meat in, I have my buddies up here. So I'm going to go over here and nerd pull back down. Oh, damn it. Where did I nerd pull up? Skippy, you're pulling the stupid. Oh, yeah, you nerd pulled up right beside where that survivor was. That is right. Is he dead now? It sounds like he, he would be dead. This guy doesn't even notice me. What's up, buddy? Okay, so let's go take a look here. Whoa! Whoa! Holy shit, the... Like, look, at, look how he chews through the walls. That's fucking insane. Just, like, nothing. That, that cop is, like, super puke, guys, so be warned. The cops are tough as fuck. Um, I'm not looking forward to that on hard nights. Definitely with the cops spit. They're gonna chew through everything like no man's land. Hey, I can actually go ahead and grab these coals now. So we did a lot of exploring as well, too. There's actually a lot of really cool POIs. Hey, you know what? I could actually... Oh, damn it. I dropped... Oh, the purse fell. Damn it. There's a purse on that table. I forgot you can pick up the tables. But we're gonna actually pick this stuff up and use it. <laughs> oh! Oh, shit. You know what? I can actually use this as storage. What am I doing? Let's start slapping some of this up because I'm probably going... Oh, shit. Skippy, do it the right way. Um, hello. 
Uh, yeah, because I'm thinking we're going to be running out of storage a lot up there. And holy crap, these cops, I tell you what. They are insane. Um, I haven't died from a cop yet. Uh, that raider, though, that raider killed me so fucking fast. Uh, we got ourselves, if we look over this way, we got ourselves a parking garage. Those things are pretty cool, but I don't think there's a lot in them. There's a lot of cars, but we, we're not really scrapping anything down right now, so that doesn't have much of a use. But, oh shit, look at all these garbage cans o bags over here. I'm going to grab this shit up while I can. Just mash that R button. There we go. Very nice. Holy shit, this place is full of garbage. They wasted a lot. Oh, painkillers. Nice. So much easier doing it this way. Oh, oh, is it two hits now for this axe? Damn it. This axe is almost broken. Slow, slow me down in my looting. Man, wow. Holy shit, this must be a custom POI. Because I have never seen this many garbage bags on the backside of a POI before. What POI is this? I don't even know which one this is. This has to be, yeah, this has to be a custom. Holy shit, there's a cop station over there. The cops are going to be crawling around like crazy. Ooh, a poppin' pills and something else? What? Ooh, I really want to check that building out. Uh, okay, what's in the front of this one? We'll, we'll take a quick gander at this building. Oh. Oh, wow, and it's like facing into another building. That's a little awkward. Whatever, it is what it is. Let's go check out this building. This this looks uh, very intriguing. What do we got going on? Okay, we got a few zombies kicking about. That door's locked. That door's locked. Uh, it, oh, you know what? I could actually make it through these bricks, but I wouldn't have enough time to friggin' do it because of all these freaking zombies. They're all over the place. Like that guy right there crawling in behind me without me seeing. Come here, buddy. Holy shit! There's a ton of crawlers here. Okay, what do we got going on? Now oh, we got another cop friend. Actually, cop friend, come here, buddy. I could use your talents. Oh, oh there's another one right there. Grab up some water, get some of that stamina back. There we go. That's why I like keeping myself thirsty sometimes as well, too, because in a pinch, drinking water both makes you unthirsty <laughs> or hydrated. And, oh, where's all my crossbow bolts? Oh, well, that's just shit. Did not mean to do that. Did he just blow a hole in that building for me? No, he did not. Damn it. Come on. I want him to blow a hole in this building. I know I can make these guys do it. Oh, shit. There's one right there, too. <laughs> Holy crap. All right. May, may, that would be insane if they actually didn't. Come here. Nice. Nah, so that's what I want to see right there. That's the action. So what I might do... Oh, shit. He's got some of the popping pill containers. Whatever. Come here, cop. I'm trying to keep these guys off me as well here, too. Oh, crap. It is all over the place. How many cops do we have? Shit. Well, that's not going to work right. He only banged out one on that. Or he only busted out one on that, too. Damn it. And now there's a spider on top of the building. Holy shit, man. This is a lot of zombies. Even getting them away from this area is going to be insane, but that building looks so valuable. Shotgun Messiah must have, like, all of the crates in it. Damn it. Another cop. And another cop. And a hornet. We're going for a run. That is completely hopeless. We are not having as much luck as we did the first time. And I think it's because um, I just came back into the game after exiting. What is this? I just came in the back into the game after exiting. So all the spawns are probably despawned. And now they're just all spawning back in. But uh, wh what is this? This would be fun to take zombies on from. Except for that hornet. That's way up there. We're cool for now. For a second. Do they do they even see me? Undetected. What? Is it because of this place? Is this some, like some sort of Masonic temple? I know that's a symbol for something. I just don't know what it's for. If you guys know, definitely let me know down in the comments. I'd, I'd love to know. But what is this madness? What is this? This is insane. It's like all concrete. This would make a sick base. Uh, will they spawn inside? Oh, I don't think they'll spawn. Oh, it's unlocked. What? Okay, you guys can stand there, break that door open. I can take care of the couple that come in here. But oh, oh this is a casino. 
Okay, this is cool. I like this. As I'm stealing all the casino's chairs so I can burn them in my in my pit. Um, but uh, they use the uh, that's clever. I love that. Wow, look at all the chairs in here. Holy shit! I'm not even paying attention. I heard her too, but I thought she was outside. My bad. Oh yeah, they run in the. Oh shit! Time to use first aid kit. I think so. Crap, I forgot they run in the dark. Holy shit, that's intense. Holy crap, man. I was not expecting them to come running like that. That was nuts. Or maybe she's just a runner, period. But they do run in the dark, so... Wow. Holy crap, did this area get mobbed quite quickly. Damn it, I want to see what's in that casino, too. That looks like a good time. Good time casinos. Man, I just... I don't... I don't have my shit together here to, to handle this. Is that survivor down? We have a survivor down? I think we do. Oh, this, oh, there's a supply crate on top of here? Fuck off. Okay, I see you, dog. I see you, and I will raise you a headshot. Come here. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Now, what I want to do is get on top of this building, because I want that supply crate, but we're going to get mobbed as fuck right here. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. It's a f food supply crate, too. That's handy. Okay, whatever. Whoa, 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 whoa! Shit, guys, this whole uh, this whole app. Oh shit, a car. Not good. Okay, um, I am slightly thirsty. Shit, we gotta get out of here. Cars are never good. Okay, okay. So what I'm gonna do here is we are gonna get on top of a building and try to get rid of some of this heat because this is just insane. This building's insane too. But we are gonna get up top. We're just gonna get up top. And see if we can't uh, take care of this situation. Because we just got way too many zombies all over the place. And I can't take this many on at this point in time. Not never, ever. Oh shit, what's this? I don't know what it is, but I'm putting a hay bale there just because I don't want to risk it. And, okay. So, I swear. Oh, I have crossbow bolts. Why aren't they loaded? Oh, it's because it's on steel. I was using up the steel ones. Oh, there we go. Okay, now we have a defense. Sorry, guys. That's my bad on that one. I didn't even notice it was a steel icon. Okay, see if we can actually clear some of these fuckers out now. That I got some crossbow bolts and we're on top of a building. Oh, wow. Look at one of those big fuckers down there, too. I think they're, I think they're aiming for that ladder. Oh, shit. Well, hello. I, uh, I forgot you guys were actually able to climb buildings because I haven't seen you do it in forever. It's about time. It's actually kind of nice seeing that. Because uh, most of the buildings I've actually been on have a ledge around them, too. On top of that. That one building that we started on, that one has a ledge on it. I'm actually going to read that. Oh, clay roof. How nice. How quaint. Alright, you're not getting me either, bitch. Ooh, you know what I should be using is a bat on this one. Oh, I one-shot her. Nice. There you go, Marlene. How do you feel about that? We got painkillers. Okay, cool. Now, we've, uh, we're just, we're sensed. Damn it. Man, we just can't catch a break here. And we've got that B over there. I really want to check out that casino. You know what? Let's go for a B line for the casino again and just see what happens. Uh, maybe I'll put a couple hay bales up in the window, just, or in the doorway, just so they, um, they don't have a way to track me. Because they don't breadcrumb right now, right? Oh, shit. They're all, like, literally right in front of this building. <laughs> That's freaking amazing. Man. Never had this many. Like, even at, even at first, we didn't have this much. This is insane. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in this way. And hopefully they don't breadcrumb in or breadcrumb in, come in, because that would really suck. But uh, we're going to take out a bat and watch just in case. I'm sensed. I think I'm okay, though. I think that might have done the job. I'm not stinky. I'm bruised. Aw, oh, damn it, I'm bruised. That sucks. Uh, bruising takes away stamina, I believe. Um, actually, we could double check that stat while I'm at it. Character, bruised, w one stamina every four seconds. Ah, shit, that's killer. Yeah, they, they, they busted right through it. Undetected. Okay, okay. Well, what are they still doing at that door then? Are they gonna, are they gonna move on? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, they're running. Oh my god. Oh, fuck. I'm fucked. Look at all of them. This was not a good idea. Why are you guys all just standing there hitting each other? Is there a way into the back that... I want to attract any attention? Shit. Oh, 
<laughs> I'm being very careful here, guys. I'll hide in the clo Ooh, there's a downstairs to this place? Nice. Nice. Okay, I'm still undetected, so we can actually go ahead and loot this stuff. Holy crap, guys, they're all standing at that doorway. That is I can't believe I got away with that. I, I can't that that's that's insane. That's just that's nuts. Okay, we're gonna scrap that. And we're gonna search this thing here as well too. Holy fuck. I can't believe we made it in here like that. And they're all just standing at the doorway. These hay bales just saved the day. They didn't do a very good job, but they, they did the job, right? Oh, man. I, I'm wondering what's in this basement now. I hope it's no metal doors. Fingers crossed there's no freaking metal doors in the basement. That would be awesome. And it looks like we've lost all our heat and everything. So that that's good. That's a step in the right direction. Uh, what's down here? Whoa, a whole bunch of these blocks. These blocks are so cool. I love them. I hope they never take them away from the game. Oh, we got some uh, We got some candles going on. Very nice. Oh, I guess it's... Oh, that's locked. Oh, and it has metal on it too. Son of a bitch. How easy are these to break through? They're, they're concrete. Ooh, 30,000. Yeah. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, well, I can't get into that one. And... Uh, man. It'd be actually almost easier to get through that than it would this. Oh, maybe not. I do more damage to concrete. And I'm sensed from doing that. Holy crap, man. Okay. Well, this is freaking cool as hell. But I don't know what's down here. I'm thinking we are uh, we's just going to get out of here. But, um, damn, I want to come and check this out again. That, that's freaking cool as hell. Okay, I think they're all up there. So we're going to have to, like, run like a fucking madman here. Shit. See, now they might see a, a solid wall in behind this. Oops. And they might not be inclined to come in. I, I, I'm feeling like, guys, we're about to have a death here. I'm feeling I've trapped myself into a really bad space. Okay, let's look around. What do we have? We have this. We can get through this. Hopefully this doesn't uh, get them too randy. Shit. Okay, I'm going to go downstairs. And I'm not going to make any noise here, guys. I'm going to lose our heat. And then what we'll do is we'll try to get up through the top here. I'll be right back after this break because this might take a while. Ah, oh, that sounds like the door. I hope I don't die. If I come back on top of the, the building, guys, you know exactly what happened. I got mobbed in here. This is kind of cool, though. I love this feeling. I haven't been trapped in the corner in so long. This, this is so freaking amazing. Anyways, guys, I'll see you right after this break. And we're back, so I'm still sensed, but I hear someone shooting a gun off up there. So that might have attracted some attention, but guys, honestly, I don't think we're going to have any luck here. We're, and, and like, I, we're, we're just going to literally have to try to bust out of here. We're going to have to try to flex and get the fuck out. I think that's the, the only way to do this. And I know they're right outside this door too, so this is, this is about to get insane. Did they break their way through this door? I'm pretty sure they did. It sounded like they did. Are we still detected? Yeah, we're still sensed. Damn it. Okay. You know what? I just want to see something. Okay, we're still good. I don't see them hitting the hay bales. If they start hitting those hay bales, we're fucking out of here. Because this building is full of them and and it's and they're running too, which really sucks. Like they're they're I can't I can't dodge them at all. Oh shit, I'm out of axes. I forgot to bring a few of those extra with me. My bad. We'll we'll make one right now. I should have done that while sitting downstairs. Damn it. And then we only have space for one right now. I'm scrap that and then make another one. There we go. Are we through? Ah oh, son of a bitch. No luck. Okay. Uh wait. What about this wall? Is that outside? That's outside, so God damn it. Of course it's concrete up there. Of course it is. Okay, you know what, guys? Kamikaze. Let's, let's give her. Oh, they didn't actually make it through. Oh, okay. All right. Well, we made it over one. Oh, sick. We made it out. Holy shit. I didn't think we were going to make it out, but we did. That's awesome. Holy crap. Look at the damage they're doing to this place. You guys are just destroying it. Oh, he's got one of those freaking big-ass guys on him. Oh, I'm glad I wasn't down there when that happened. All right, 
So let's uh, let's blow this popsicle stand. Holy, what the fuck's going on over there? Let's blow this popsicle stand and go and find something that's a little easier to loot because this is just bad. Like I love the uh, the the loot city, the hub city, but I just I can't handle this. This is just running away from zombies the entire time. I mean, we did get some decent loot, but I just I can't get the zombies off of me right now. Um, oh boy. I got another gas station going on here. Maybe I should do a drive-by. And uh, we do have a few of the mansions and the POIs we had. Ooh, that must have sucked. Uh, that we had from the last playthrough. I do... Uh, no, that's actually a new one. I haven't seen that one yet. That's completely different. It's a modern one, but it's not the same one. Okay. Uh, now, that building was over here. So, I do have the icon because it's my bed icon. Big, big dumbass on that one. We're going to head over there. And see what I can bring back with me, and then we'll leave the non-valuables um, here, and then just keep going on our way. Holy crap, there's an army base right here. Oh, wow, and look look at all the landmines. See you later, zombies. <laughs> there it goes. That, wow, it took two landmines? Is it dead? No way, it's still friggin' alive, and it took two landmines. That's insane. And yes, I hear ya, you little bastard. Come here. Oh, you know what? These things are actually better to take out with arrows. Oops. If I can freaking hit the damn thing. Come here. There we go. Oh, wow. Are you running now, you little bitch? Nope, nope. He's coming back. Oh, wow. This thing takes a beating. I swear I only hit it with one. Uh, the last one I hit only took, a, like, one or two. Oh, sick. Whatever. We got it. Let's see if we can get any more bladders out of this thing. Uh, we'll toss the glue. Uh, pfft. I'm going to leave the old chairs up there, actually. And electric wire. We'll toss that as well here, too. Let's see what this guy gives us. He should give us meat as well, too. Nice. You know what? I'll take the meat over anything at this point. Um, I'm surprised we don't have a shitload of zombies on us. Especially now that I have meat. Okay. I th Did I only get that one? Okay, no. We got two meat. We got two meat from that. It's not bad. It's a tiny spider. I really don't expect much from it. But, um... Oh, you know what? Ugh. It's the chassis and the wheel that is broken on my mini bike. The wheel's not a big deal. All I have to do is um, hit one of those on the ground. They they spawn so are there's so many of them. It doesn't freaking matter. Okay, here we go. Drink some. Oh, okay. I'm not thirsty. All right, so we're gonna get back up to the roof here, and hopefully this cop doesn't spit all over us in the process. Or on my nerd pole. That would really suck as well, too. That's, that's happened. I've been nerd pulling up to the top of a building. And I've had a cop spit it out from underneath me. And, yep. Sprained ankle. That figures, right? Okay. So we have uh, some of our food going on here. So I'm going to go ahead and stick our meat into the... Actually, you know what? Let's stick our meat into Bob here. Where are you? Ah, there's Bob. Bob's an asshole. So he deserves the meat. Where, where did I put it? Oh, it's already in the fire pit. Oh, you're lucky, Bob. You got away this time. But we have um, oil and crap, which I really don't need. That can stay here. I'll come back with like a mini bike and loot it all again one day. Um, these old chairs can stay for this fire pit. And I will take my planks back. Thank you very much. Yes, I just did that. I went there, guys. Um, coal, I'm going to hold on to because uh, it's only 14. Yeah, you know what? We'll leave, we'll leave the coal behind. Uh, cloth fragment. Pretty much anything that's common, except for the candles. I can use those. Anything that's common, I won't take with me, and then we'll go back and then uh, see what we can do about hitting some stuff up. Because, yeah, this this whole thing's just not working out right now. And then when we get back to the city, I'll put my other bed back down so we can give her a go. Oh, look at that. I found a hook, apparently. That's freaking awesome. So I have another hook for, for fishing. Oh, I can't wait to do that either. Okay, so everything else, pretty much, uh, even feathers I need at this point, so we can still use some arrows. But I do want to save a lot of my crossbow bolts and stuff for Horde Knight. Speaking of... We got to look through the rest of our um, friends here. I'm going to take the weapon repair kits with me. Uh, rounds, gas barrels, um, sharpening stone. I'm not sure what that is, but that can stay here for now. Um, scrap iron tables. You know what? I'm going to take those with me just because of the iron value of them. Uh, stone knives, crossbow. Or, um, I'm sorry. That's not the crossbow. That's a compound bow. Steel crossbow bolts. Any ammo. That all works. Perfect. Sweet. Okay. So oh, now, now I'm full. I'm um, like, perfect. We're, we're good to go, but now I'm full. So I'm going to leave these stone knives here, actually. How many do I have on me? Okay, so I have a steak knife. That'll break soon. Stone knife, I'll break that after. And then I'll try to use up this old stone axe as well, too. And then we'll take a look at what I what I can get rid of. 
red tea I should actually put that right into my belt because I'm gonna be using that for stamina as we go so let's go ahead and get back down and head so you know back towards town uh, there is a couple things I wanted to check out here so we're gonna run by my mini bike this is gonna be a little bit of a run but whatever and uh, oh wait this biome sucks too so we, we really got to give her um, I'm gonna go all the way up. what's what's here I don't know, but let's, let's just give her. Let's, let's give her down and get the fuck out of here. I, I wish there was a short way out of this biome, but this biome is just fucking nasty. Nasty. So I got to head towards my uh, my marker, basically. It's going to go down that way and head east. So let's go and uh, get the fuck out of here. Because these guys are kicking my ass. We could definitely got to come back here at one point. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, that would explain why that hole was there. That would definitely explain why the hole was there. I was not expecting to see that. I look in, this freaking cop just comes running at me. Fuck. Well, at least there's a hole in the building now. Next time we go back, we can actually check out what that building is. That thing looks pretty cool. I don't know what it is or what it does, but I love it. So, if you're just joining me for this as well too, guys. Small hint, if you're using True Survival, um, SDX, or the old version. Uh, running or Roads are your best friend. You get increased movement speeds on the roads. So, if you can... Stick to the roads. It'll save you, save you stamina, save you time. Uh, but just be warned, everything else is also quicker on the road as well, too. So running zombies are even quicker when they get on the asphalt. And it's not just the roads, too. Like, they'll run on the asphalt in POIs. Like, the asphalt here, they'll, they'll run on this shit. Oh, look at, look at all the loot over here. What do we have? A glass jar. I'll take that. I'm not going to take that rotting flesh, though. It looks like some of these bodies are just starting to despawn and leave their stuff behind. What is this? Man, zombies die so randomly now, it's insane. There we go, we'll keep scrapping stuff to get stuff, and definitely grab some of that. Ah, oh, nothing in this one, that sucks. Um, I love those things, because they drop a good amount of coal. Like, you really don't have to farm the coal, if you can hit up enough ember piles. But uh, let's get the hell out of here. Oh, we have another, another spider at us. Uh, it looks like there's, I, I really love that animation of the barrel, with the, um, with radiation coming out of it. That is freaking crazy. The waste. That looks so cool. Oh, and look. There's actually like a waste. Oops. I'm fucking standing in it too. Uh, there's a waste pool on it. Oh, that's, that's that's actually really freaking neat. I like that. Nice little detail. Oh, and of course you got corpses in here. We're not going to loot those. Now, I, I drove through all this. So I actually didn't get a chance to check it out. But we're, uh, we're going slower this time. So we definitely will now. Uh, the one thing I do have to watch out for is those dogs. Those fucking dogs suck balls. But I don't believe it's, um, I don't believe this actually has a dog horde. I know there's random hordes for random days. Um, I haven't bothered memorizing them because I'd just rather be surprised by a random watering horde. Like that screamer horde was insane in that, in that one city. It's just like, what the fuck is going on here? There's a bunch of screamers coming at me. Oh, man. See, that was a blast. See, if I expected that, I would have been like, oh, it's a screamer horde. You know what I mean? That's why I love playing this way sometimes. I'll get better at it, and eventually I'll be like, okay, well, I don't know this. I haven't found this out yet, and I will go look everything up, and then I'll be very well versed. So Alpha 16, like, the playthrough will probably be a lot different. Stuff won't be as big of uh, a surprise to me. But, oh, shit, there's a lot of zombies up there. You know what? I'm going to take advantage of your situation here. And you're going to come along with me. There we go. Yeah, it's, uh, but anyways, Alpha 16 is going to be really interesting to see. Because I'll be a lot more versed. Uh, we'll get up and running a lot quicker. And this this is the new version of True Survival SDX as well, too. If you guys check it out, actually, uh, Spider, the guy who makes this uh, mod, has uh, actually commented on the videos a few times. He's a pretty chill guy. Okay, let's, uh, let's get going here and just get out of this freaking nasty-ass biome. Oh, wow. Noted, you can't go under that tree. That custom tree that's laying down, yeah, that's none of your business. You can't have that. I keep thinking those are spiders. Those things trip me right out. Okay. Uh, now, I kind of do get the uh, random light poles with all the land random buildings that are torn down. Uh, that one lamp pole, though, that was in the middle of nowhere. That, that one truly made me laugh. That was actually pretty funny. <laughs> oh, man. Those garbage bags, great loot. Um, even these, actually. Backpacks, I can break open as well, too. Because, oh, shit. I didn't think it was going to hit me. My bad. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to use a band-aid. Band-aid. We got some acid spit going on. So um, we're going to have to stay away. For what acid spit does is attract other zombies. It's like having a smell, basically. From from what I remember. From 
what I was told. If we go here, uh, acid is melting your skin, washing it off. Oh, it also does your stamina and health every one second. So yeah, it, uh, it's a damage over time thing. Kind of sucks. It's uh, up there for quite a while, but whatever. Hey, are we even heading in the right direction? We are not. We are not. I'm going down the wrong road. No wonder why I didn't see any of this shit. So what we're going to do here is just continue heading east. And then we should meet up with the other biome. But what we got to do is also keep an eye out for those fucking landmines. Good God. You know what? I haven't actually ever been taken out by a landmine. Um, wow. Except for that one time. The one time just recently where I died in this episode where I hit the fucking landmine. Man, I couldn't believe that. Like, that's why, that's why I think I was like, what the fuck? Because usually I'm pretty good at looking at the ground in this biome for landmines because those things suck balls. Yes, I'd much rather deal with a winter biome than landmines at this point because landmine would one-time me at, right now. Like, it's, it's good enough to one-time me. But, hey, we're not crawling with zombies at the moment, so I'll take that. Uh, let's scrap this. Let's scrap those. There we go. And we're almost back home. It's actually kind of nice uh, sightseeing this time because uh, the last couple times all I did was just basically run back and forth. Oh, ah, it looks like you just came down from the tree, dude. That was a little weird. Oh, it's 1900. I didn't even notice the time either. We really got to get our ass fucking home and uh, to safety. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. Um, or at least to a POI. Where's, uh, where's the closest one? Oh, it's just right over here. And there's a treasure over there from that treasure map up ahead. Okay. You know what? I'll hide up on top of this POI. We'll go check this one out, and this will be my nighttime POI. Oh, and there's a fucking lumberjack over there. Not going to be taking that one on, I can tell you guys that. Okay. Oh, tree stump. Give me something good. These things usually give you something pretty damn good. I like tree stumps. They're, they're a great loot. Ah, just painkillers. Oh, speaking of painkillers, I should probably use some of those. Um, I will in a second here, once we can get on top of a building. Oh man, I'm gonna I'm gonna freeze too because it's fucking cold. What is this? This is oh, it's 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 the um, is this the lumber mill or the hotel? I think this one's a resort. Uh, but what we're gonna do is just nerd pole on top of this resort. And if I freeze, I freeze. But I think I think we'll be okay. What I can do is I believe actually get into the building, and that should help a little bit. So it will keep me from getting wet. And they shouldn't be able to make their way up, I think. Uh, let's see here. I think the top floor... It's been a while since I've been in this, but I think this is just a viewing room. So what I'm going to do is uh, break open the glass, yeah? Oh, look at the hay bales with uh, with snow on top of them. That's awesome. Damn it, I should have gone right beside the building. I wasn't even thinking. You know what? Let's go right beside the building. This guy's all pissed off, but whatever. He can suck it up. There we go. Yeah, we'll go right beside the building. That way I don't have to, like, risk hopping and then falling and breaking my shit. Because that happens. Alright, cool. So we're up in here. I'm not getting wet. My wetness isn't going up, so we're good. We should uh, start drying off. Uh, now, I don't think I have enough to build a campfire, so I'm going to go camp. What do, we do? what do we need? We need four plant fibers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and grab a couple plant fibers... And then we're going to turn those into a fire pit. And then I can sit on that windowsill all night and they can bang up this place all they fucking want. Because I don't give a shit. But I would like to loot it. That would be pretty cool. Oh, man. I think they, they've taken out my nerd pole already. That's all right, though. It won't take long to get back up there. I'm going to grab a couple extra. There you guys. Oh, look, a crawling one. Isn't that fucking terrifying? Holy shit, look at all of them. There's a ton of these fuckers. Good thing they're slow as fuck. Oh, another one right around the corner, of course. Oh, you can't place those on dumpsters? Are you kidding me? Fuck, man. <laughs> Jeez. This just ain't working out for me here. Okay, let's just get up here. Oh, the hay bale fucked up. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. Okay. One more try at this. Ah, here we go. This this will work. Right here. Don't break my... Don't break it. Don't break it. Nice. Good to go. Now, they might break those ones, and that's okay. So, uh, this level here, I don't think they can reach me at. No. This is it. this is the upper level. Okay, cool. So, what I'm going to do here, guys, is I'm going to break this out, spend the night hiding under this cover so I don't get wet and freeze to death. Uh, ooh, we're already 60 degrees. Um, make myself a campfire. 
light that shit up and keep myself warm for the night and just uh, chill out here because they can smash up this place. And I will see you in Monday's episode. Have a good one, guys. Thank you for joining us. You've been cool. Keep it classy. Always survive. And always back up those game saves. Hit it, you bunch of dirty hippies.